<laughs> what will they go through if you laugh if you laugh look at me look at that show see your cross up stay jesus christ the son of god you are more than enough more than enough for me oh hey she move Hmm. Sure, you say you want puffy. I give you puffy. Another craving king. I've eaten all the things you want me to eat. What is you want? Allow me to record. Please. What's the time now? Is it like 2? 2 a.m. 2 a.m. Eh, you're sleeping and I'm not sleeping. There's no me that. You will not come and press boy for me. Please. In Jesus' name. Allow me to record. Amen. Thank you. I love you, yeah? Thank you. <sighs> Wait till they go through. <laughs> if you laugh. If you laugh. Look at me. Look at that show. See your cross up stay. <laughs> uh, hey! Go on and stream our album. Why do they laugh at you now? <laughs> go and stream our album. Hmm? Oh yeah, baby, talk to them. Yeah, I see the daddies and mommies. Please go and stream my mommies. Oh. <laughs> God bless you. Thank you. Bye. You guys, <laughs> it's really not easy. Motherhood and all it comes with. See yesterday now, remember I shared a video um two days ago where I was um, talking about Mr. Trinworth saying that uh, motherhood affected her in no little way and also made her more, you know, dogged, more um, determined to succeed and everything. So you see, <laughs> part of the determination is the fact that in that video she shared, she was recording at 2 a.m. If you are a pregnant woman, you know what 2 a.m. means. If you've been, if you've ever been pregnant, you know what 2 a.m. means. 2 a.m. is like sleeping time. Early hours of the morning is when the sleep is sweetest. So you see that she stood up, got dressed, you know, <laughs> went to the studio to go and record. I could see her saying, "Oh, I've given the baby parfait. I've given her cross soup. You know, what else do you want? Allow me to record." Because it was still hard for her. It was not easy, but she was determined. When I saw the video of her in the studio, I was like, I was shocked first. I was like, oh, she recorded these songs when she was pregnant? Because I was actually thinking that she recorded them after she had put to bed and everything. But no, she recorded most of them or maybe all of them when she was pregnant. And you guys also know that even when she was pregnant, she was still, you know, going on ministration. She was still singing, even though, yes, people were hinting, oh, she was pregnant and all that. People were saying maybe she just, you know, um, just got married and maybe it was a beautiful, <laughs> you know, the marriage weight gain and everything. But it just goes to show that even when she was still heavy, still pregnant, she was doing her thing. And shout out to her husband, like I said in the other video, because it takes support from left, right, and center to be able to do that as a pregnant woman. It is not an easy feat. It is not. Look at her begging baby just, just to record, you know. And you know also that pregnancy affects women's voices. If you know, let me know in the comment section. Pregnancy makes some, women voice, some women's voices deeper or lighter and all that, but... You can imagine her still struggling pushing through trying to sound you know as herself and still recording doing pregnancy shout out to her really shout out to her you know in that video she was just really sharing um, her experiences with pregnancy and she said go and, re go and listen to the album so her baby is beg even begging now baby is out album is out and everything is just going well see listen if you're a mother i know that it's not easy for everybody and it's not the same experience for everybody not everybody has the same level of help that mr chima might have had and everything but just do your best don't relent you know um don't relent even with pregnancy with everything as much as you can I, like i said i'm trying to be very sensitive some women when they get pregnant they are sick also so they cannot even function it's fine when you put to bed you know pick up yourself start from where you stopped it's not the end of the world that you could not do much as a pregnant woman you know just pick up yourself and just try and do the best you can do your children will be proud of you even you will be proud of yourself and all the you know battles that you fought and won while creating a human being or even after creating a whole human being See, listen if you're a woman just you know give yourself a thumbs up because we are too much eh? or too much but let me know your thoughts are in the comment section about my situation and her 
experiences during pregnancy singing and you know all the struggles she had to face to put out an album you know you know to put out her work for you it might not be an album it might be your job you know your shop your business just share us out guys in the comment section it's the real show thank you for watching like share subscribe i will see you in my next video bye bye